Hi, so this one's going to be a bit all over the place camera wise, so I do apologise if my hand is shaky. Today we're looking at a new upgrade to the workshop, which is this Cricut. And as you can see, there's a blade here which allows me to do electronic die cutting. Now, currently the blade I've got can't do thick card, so we're just getting to grips with it at the moment and at some point I'll try cutting pasta card. Here we have a gothic window I did. It's made up of three parts. This wide open window shape, the panes which are within it, and then a border. And when it's all put together, you get this panel. Wait a second, I'm missing a bit here. There we go, one, two, three. And you get this recessed panel, which is pretty cool. And a few of these set along a <coughs> wall, oh, do excuse me, is gonna make a fantastic kind of chapel scene. Now, onto the good stuff. Here you see the Cricut design space, and in a paint program, I put together this bulkhead design, loaded it in. And I can go here and change the size. So we're going to make it 80 by 80. And we're going to pop it in to the corner. And from here, I can do all sorts of things. I can choose to have lines drawn and put a pen into the machine. I can have them scored to help fold, have the cuts. Uh, I can choose the exact position where it goes on the page and then when I go to this make it section it shows me where the cut's happening um, which goes on this mat here. Right, that's a basic ramble through the new machine. I'll be showing you more of the stuff I do with it as time goes on and I'm going to upload some files onto Patreon which you can use if you've got your own Cricut. Right. See you around.